You know, the one nice thing about leading off the pay-per-view is you know exactly what time you're going to fight. How important is that to you? And talk to me about what your warm-ups what, what your warm ups like. If, if you know you're fighting a little bit past 10 p.m. Eastern time, when do you actually start mm -hmm. breaking a sweat and warming up? Uh, you know, you want to break. You want to start breaking a sweat maybe an hour in advance, uh, leading to the fight. You start, you start, you know, getting getting your body loose, getting uh, the sweat running a little bit. I think, I think uh, within the hour is, is a good thing. Is a good, good time to start. Let's talk a little bit about your your opponent. He, he's only been to decision one time. He has 16 wins by finish. A very aggressive style. Do you feel like that could open you up for some counterattacking, or do you feel like you're going to match his intensity? I'm gonna match his intensity. You know, it's just uh, I've I've had I've I've faced countless uh, aggressive uh, opponents that are coming forward. It's just not something that I haven't faced before. So, Eves, is the bullseye more on him, Thomas Almeida, or on that big zero next to the 17? He's 17 and 0 undefeated. Next to him, he's, he's uh, the record doesn't really. I don't focus on that, you know. Like somebody could have like a like a record that doesn't look that good, but like he's an amazing fighter. Somebody can have a a super, uh, you know, like the 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 record doesn't mean anything. Like he's at, at the end of the day, he's a human being uh, with a set of skills against my set of skills. I focus on the person, not on where or the background or anything.